Hello everybody, Smithy here, and welcome to another Minecraft Jurassic World Jurassic Craft episode, and we're on the InGen Stroke Biosyn Island 2, where we finished off the last video, uh, and as you can see, I've done a bit of building, I've done some of the boring stuff, which is put the new road in. Remember rightly, we had a bit of a gap between that and that. So you can see that it's all lit up and we're going to have a closer look before we uh, nip back into the, and uh, pressing too many buttons again. Yeah, let's go and have a look what we do. So I've continued, and we'll look at the dark and then I'll show you in daylight. So I've continued the bridge. Now that's from the main island, the main base, sunrise is coming. And this is this beautiful, look at this. What a beautiful sunrise. And uh, what I've done is, remember I said the road didn't quite match up? Well, it does now, look. So the main connection road from the main laboratory name base to this island uh, where we're going to put some herbivores out uh, comes down here to this dock so we can uh, bring stuff in via the boat or we can bring stuff in by, via the uh, road. Now, originally when we first came to the island years ago, it was just the boat dock. But they've now created this uh, to bring the uh, young dinosaurs down to here. So you can see that I've got to continue putting all the blocks in on both sides uh, to the doorway. And then also put the uh, wire gates in as well. I've done that one. So this one should be about right as well. So I've got to literally go down and put all these blocks in here. Because I thought it would be good to put like a, a curve area because we are in a forest. Uh, what I what I didn't do though is I just left it like that. I wasn't going to start messing around with slopes and stuff because this is a rough terrain, whereas that over there was quite smart. As such, uh, so I'm going to put this in, and I'm going to put the fence in, and, uh, and then we're going to go and set up our first reserve area uh, on this island. So I think I've decided we're going to bring in two dinosaurs today. Uh, into their new area but I've got to go and prepare it because remember we don't want them wandering all over the island uh, everywhere and this will do look at this bring this back around here and you can see when I get to here guys that uh, yeah <laughs> I've still got to get rid of some of the trees of course don't want that one there but I've noticed when I've got rid of them not all the leaves disappear straight our way uh, so some of it stays and then the rest of the tree stays there so it's not very good but uh, it works as well as it can do and the leaves will go eventually uh, when we come back and disappear from the map but I like to help them on the way and smash a few leaves uh, so thank you very much guys for all the comments and the uh, likes etc it's well appreciated remember this, this channel is all about dinosaurs and other minecraft animals because uh, we're starting a, new, very, a very new series soon and I'm going to do some mod showcases as well because there's some mods that we're using uh, in that last episode that I haven't shown you the whole mod so I thought because there's hardly any videos on it mineralogy mod I'm going to do a showcase for you all you may have seen it I can think whether I put it out before this video or not so let's just do this that line's alright there's a couple there uh, so what I'm going to do guys is I'm just going to finish off this is just a basic dock so I'm going to finish off the pathways and the lighting uh, and then I'll just come out oh that's from the uh, old dock area so I'll finish off this area and then come back oh yes we could use the uh, lighting couldn't we because we're using the CFM mod uh, the furniture mod that's another mod we're using and we've got iron Iron metals, base metals as well on this mod, so this is some of the new mods that you'll see me using forever and a day. I won't be putting too many mods in these episodes, because if you want to download and see all the stuff, you need to download my mod pack. So if you ever download my mod uh, maps in future, and this map is not going to be ready for a while guys, so don't ask me. Because we've got, we've got to build a load of stuff in between the other videos as well, and Jurassic World, and Jurassic Park. Right, so I'll be back shortly once I have done the rest of the fencing. No fence in there, and I'll be around there and put the light on to show you. So we're back, guys. We've finished the road, and uh, I'm in this is going to be an access valley here, but I'm not going to do any more road building on this episode uh, because I want to have a bit of fun, but I just want to show you. All the lights are in because... 
this I would have this as a compound area with a fence uh, across here. Funny enough, I think we may be able to put uh, roads around the around the outside of the island. Uh, I'm not sure yet how I'm going to do that, but let's just show you this anyway. We're going to look at this. So here is the exit for this beautiful bunker. And so I'm going to keep these designs now for the rest of this island. Coming out here, here is the road coming out back there and all the way over there and then we go back over the bridge uh, to the other side so what we got to do first things first is I'm gonna find us I'm gonna have a look at this island now to see which area we're gonna expand upon first and I think it might be that bit, this bit over here because it's the bit that you drive over to uh, as such so it's all pretty happy in terms of that sunrise is coming as you say again I do like sunrise with shaders on it is fantastic and I, I haven't done this this is going to be for another episode because we haven't done the proper road up into the main complex where we will have all oh sun's coming through there where we'll have all the, the laborator laboratories and stuff uh, under the mountain so anyway we're going to head back to the island for you and uh, well, I'm gonna have a quick look round just to select a good place and then come back and we'll try and introduce our first dinos into this reserve over the far side right guys so uh, because I wanted to include four we've got four that uh, one two one two one two three yeah four very similar uh, dinos into this area I've decided that uh, this area over here was going to be our first dino reserve so what I've done in the meantime well let me just show you uh, I, I was able to pour some of the fences in ie these are these literally are medium-sized fences that I've had in my other parks and so you can see I've put four sections in there uh, but then all this here is hand-built I had to literally hand-build so I just literally made the fence go up the hillside to try and stop the dinos uh, coming out. And these are all uh, uh, dinos that you won't have seen very often in Jurassic Craft because we've got the 1.8 pre-release 3. Again, I do say to people, if you want this, go and head to my Planet Minecraft page where my mods folder is there. Not all the mods we're using here at the moment. I will update the mods folder, but it has got the Jurassic Craft Dino uh, Pack mod uh, version, mod version two, pre-release three, which you is the rarest, but I still believe is the best. So over here, we've got another similar fence where I've put two sections in and then I had to manually go at the field. And you can see here, I've put some stuff underneath. Now. If the eagle eye among you will have noticed there's a weird gap here and there's no water, but you can't see anything. Uh, but look what I've got in my hand. I've got the invisible barrier. So if I have that in my hand, and let's go down here, you will see the invisible barrier. There you go. The invisible barrier is now here. Uh, and if I take this off, go back to here, you will see it disappear. And even when that's it you can't see it invisible barrier brilliant i remember someone told me about this ages ago but i've never used it i will have to use it for this world because we do not want to go off now i could what i could have done is put the barrier along the beach and you wouldn't notice but hey it doesn't really matter i'm quite happy because once i take this away you can't see it it disappears there you go it disappears right so let's put it back at the, so they there's no fences along the top of the mountains now, so these dinos climb, so they might escape. They might escape, but hey, this is a natural reserve. Uh, and up here to stop them escaping, let's see, can you see it? Can you see it anywhere? Can you see anywhere? Can you see? Can you see a line anywhere? No, it's but show you guys. Hello, where are you? It's down here somewhere, I'm sure it is. Yay, there you go. There's my invisible fence, guys. So uh, I put that all the way up there and all the way across. So that should stop them running away because when you get to here, you can't get out. It's pretty good, isn't it? It's very clever, isn't it? So the other thing is, what I decided to do is uh, I really should 
uh, like have a field area and I think the only way to do that is go around and take some of these out and then we'll come back and there'll be a little like grazing area because all the grass should uh, disappear as such sorry the leaves will disappear don't want the grass to disappear because you want your dinos to eat that so so if I just go around and take a few of these out uh, and then we should get some grass growing as we log in and log out that's the only thing with the pre-used mat that you have to take out some of the stuff uh, and it's just about for these it's just taking out some of the trunks but I'm not going to do much more of that because what we want to do is show you some dinos to go in our reserves so let's go over here what we're going to do is release them uh, on the beach and see what happens we'll probably all head for the water knowing dinos but we shall see so what's up let's see what we got we have got four dinos guys we have got the lambiosaurus we have got the parasophilophus so you know which family of dinos this is we have got the edmontosaurus and we finally but not least we've got the corifosaurus so let's start backwards let's go for the normal parasophilophus parasophilophus let's put this over here uh, we'll put that first, Parasophilophus. We will have the Lambiosaurus. Oh no, I like the Lambiosaurus, put that last. We'll have the. Ooh, no. Yeah, so, so we'll have the Edmontosaurus and the Corifosaurus there and finish off the Lambiosaurus. So let's start with the Parasophilophus. So put the Parasophilophus over here so we can see what we're having. Now, is this the one that. Oh, I can't remember. This is the one, maybe. That we, I can't remember which version it is. I think we shall try and see what happens, guys. It's not the one you shine up in the air and change it, it won't change it. So let's have a go over here. First one in, first one in. Let's see. <sighs> Do we get a boy or a girl? Hey! Oh, 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 oh. Boy, hey, oh, oh. Can you go any further? You are so good. Right, let's see if it will change it now. That's oh, a baby if you if you are oh, they do eat uh, look at that so let's try a normal adult that's two and the hunting packs yay super duper now we can use a game roll which i forgot is this one it might be this one we'll see what happens if they start dying uh and i can't remember where yes it is this one where if i do slash uh game rule slash forward slash game rule di capital letters dino metabolism true uh, false it will tell me it will tell me where it's happening so look yeah so now they won't starve but they will still eat see them all eating it's well cool so it won't starve now they can't get out this is good because hopefully it'll all stay down here so let's go and put the lovely Edmontosaurus over here. Let's go for it. This is well cool. Edmontosaurus. Da, 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 da. Oh, hey! Wow. That is good, isn't it? This is the advantage of having this uh, Jurassic Craft. It is superb. They should have just kept, they should have gone back to this one and sort of finished it off, really. It's really cool. I do like it. Sorry, Jurassic Craft. These are so cool. Uh, and these are just the, like you could say, the boring dinosaurs, but they're not boring. So let's get another one. Let's try another one. Oh, same again. Same again. And can we get another one? Oh, they're all the same. Are they all the same? Oh, hold on. Yeah, they are. Right, let's just try one more. See, I don't know whether there's any difference here, guys. That's got a red head, tail. Mm, I'm not that mm, I'm not sure guys where there's any difference there anyway so that's the Edmontosaurus we'll leave that there I'll, shall we try one more I can't remember if these are different probably get someone will tell me is that one over there got a different tail no they're all the same aren't they yeah right okay I can never right Corifosaurus people this is uh, ooh now this might be ooh hold well on let's get some time set day let's get them back yeah, there we go. Let's come down here. Might have to ship some of those ones out. <gasps> Look at this! Oh, food. Aren't you gorgeous? This one, this one will have... 
the yellow one and the green one. Oh, there's another yellow one, another yellow one, another yellow one. Let's see if I can change it. Another yellow one, another yellow one, another yellow one. Hurrah! A green one at last. Hey, no slowdown, am I? I'm getting no slowdown. But we'll have to get rid of some of them. There's too many guys, but just for this, isn't it fun? Right, so the last but not least is the Lambiosaurus. Now, this is so cool if you've not seen this one before. If you want to see all the uh, Jurassic Craft 2 dinos, go and search showcase in my links. I've done a number of showcases, and this one is about the... I've actually got us uh, an episode, two episodes, which is Jurassic Craft 2 showcase pre-release three dinosaurs and flying reptiles. And you can go and head out and have a look at them all, all the different ones. So hopefully I'm showing you something different. So this is well cool. Look at this. Look at the hat on this. That's the blue hat one. Now I can't remember. I'll have to, what I'll have to do is get the... Uh, Dino pad. Aha! There's the purple headed one. I call it hat. They are so good. They are so good. I just love them. They're, they're brilliant. There's another purple headed one. I wanted four, really. Uh, wow, look at that. Hey, they might. Oh, are they going to start eating all the trees? Isn't that cool? That is so cool. Wow, look at this. This is a, yeah, this is going to be, uh, let's have this as my screenshot, I think. It looks pretty cool, doesn't it? So there we go. We'll use that as a screenshot. Right, so there we go. And uh, they seem to be behaving, which is staying by the water. It's really cool. It'll be interesting to see over the next few weeks how, um, what happens to them. These don't move very far, but they're really cool. And it really wants me uh, in my... It's funny enough in my Jurassic Craft series we haven't like introduced lots of it really but to make I've got a new series coming where we're going to breed or well I've got another series with the uh, the first series is the uh, Revenge of the Sea Team where we're going to try I'm going to try and just breed every single uh, dino and uh, make some pens for them. Uh, what are these doing? Are they fighting? Are they having a good scrap? They're actually oh whoa 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 fight on what's going on? See. They're eating. They're eating the grass, but are they actually clearing? They can't eat the trees because the trees can't go. There's no way they can eat those trees. It's quite interesting, but they are. Oh, they. What's they hold on. Whether they trample stuff, I'm not sure. But funny, it must be the grass are off upstairs. But they're already starting to venture in, so it's quite good actually. I'll leave the. Leave the areas I was having a bit of a spin. So I hope you enjoyed that episode, guys. We've got through quite a lot by fixing the tunnel over here and putting the road in. And then obviously putting our first set of dinos in there. I think we we want to find a space for our biggest, biggest dino. Uh, and another one we haven't done is the Physosaurus. So thank you very much indeed for watching, guys. Uh, we'll be back very soon for another episode. We are moving off the Indian Island. We are going back somewhere else next episode. Uh, so we'll wait and see where we go. So thank you very much for watching and uh, please have a look at my other series which uh, will be breeding dinos and different types of dinos from the fossils in Archaeology Mod and this Jurassic Craft Mod and then the new animal Minecraft animal series which will be also starting on as well. So bye for now and I will take care.